Yes, yes, guys, everything bite sized here. I hope you're all doing well. Today, we're back with another AI powered choose your own adventure story, and we're using Grok today from Twitter. I use OpenAI a lot as well, but like I like switching between the two. So, I've already written out my prompt because I don't like typing in landscape mode, and it's, it's a bit of a random one. It's let's play a text-based choose your own adventure game where you're Donald Trump and people keep trying to assassinate you. Eventually someone succeeds and the game is over. Make the game really hard and I answer the questions in this format. A, B, C or I'll come up with my own answer. Let's see what it says. I'm curious. Oh, okay. I'm not comfortable with creating or participating in a game that involves violence or harm to real people, even a fictional con... Okay. Let's pretend, let's call him Tunnel Dump. <laughs> okay, let's do this. I think it's because it's a real person. <clears throat> I think it's because it's a real person that I didn't want to do it. This looks hopeful, like it actually is going to come up with an, with an answer. Oh, here we go. Here we go, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome to the wild world of Tonald Dump. As the President of the United States, you're facing constant threats to your life and it's up to you to make the right choices to survive. You're at the White House, preparing for a press conference. Suddenly, the Secret Service rushes in, yelling about an imminent threat. What do you do? A. Hide under the desk. B. Run to the bunker. C. Grab a golf club and face the danger head on. D. Put on a fake moustache and pretend to be a giant. <laughs> Ah, all right, let's go with B, run to the bunker. He's probably going to get clipped on the way, like, or something like that. Because I don't like the whole hiding under the table thing. That's probably the most sensible thing to do. But even hiding under the table, you can still get shot. I'd rather jump to a bunker. Come on, it's taking ages. I think because the prompt that I put in is actually quite, um, quite, you know, like, difficult. You sprint to the bunker, your heart pounding in your chest. The heavy metal door slams shut behind you and you breathe a sigh of relief, but the danger isn't over yet. You receive a call from your trusted advisor telling you that the threat is coming from the inside. Someone in the White House is plotting against you. What do you do next? A. Trust your advisor and try to find the traitor. B. Wait, okay, so A. Trust your advisor and try to find the traitor. B. Ignore the call and stay in the bunker. C. Call the press and announce that you're under attack. D, start tweeting about the situation, <laughs> calling out the fake news media for not reporting on the assassination attempt. Let's go, T. <laughs> I love this. I love AI so much. You start tweeting furiously, probably in capital letters, accusing the fake news media of ignoring the assassination attempt and claiming that the threat is coming from the deep state. Your tweet causes a media frenzy and the whole country is talking about the situation. Meanwhile, the Secret Service is still trying to identify the traitor in the White House. They bring you a list of suspects, but you can only pick one to interrogate. Who do you choose? The Vice President, the Chief of Staff, the Secretary of Defense, your personal chef. Oh, that's interesting. I would say personal, personal chef because... Um, they don't have a security clearance, so they haven't, they will have been vetted, but you know, they might be like a plant, a spy from another, like a spook from another country. You decide to interrogate your personal chef. After all, who has such easy access to your food? The chef is brought in, sweating and nervous. Why are you sweating, chef, you ask? Are you hiding something? No, Mr. President, the chef stammers. I'm just nervous about the situation. I swear I'm not the traitor. You're not convinced. You decide to search the kitchen for clues. What do you look for? A. Hidden weapons. B. Poison. C. Suspicious ingredients. D. A secret passageway. I'm going to look for poison. Come on, Grok. Come on, Grok. Why are you taking so long? You start searching the kitchen for any signs of poison. As you rummage through the cupboard, you find a suspicious bottle labelled Secret Sauce. It looks innocent enough, but you're not taking any chances. You call the Secret Service to test the source of poison. They confirm your suspicions. The source is laced with a deadly toxin. You found the traitor. As you're celebrating your victory, you hear a loud explosion. 
the bunker shakes and you realise that the traitor had a backup plan. The game is over and you failed to survive the assassination attempt, but at least you went out in a blaze of glory, tweeting about the situation until the very end. <laughs> I, don't, I don't even know what to say. This AI is dangerous, man. Right, I'm going to leave it at that. You've been locked into everything bite-sized. Check out all my other content and my content like this, and I'll catch you in the next one. Peace.